smash.gg slash the monthly. That's where you're going to want to go to check uh, to check out all the action and follow along for yourselves. And once again, that shout outs to everyone in the chat. Shout outs to everyone who's rocking along here. Whether you're watching on our VOD channel, Bros Calamity Vods, or of course, live here on twitch.tv slash bros underscore calamity. This is a very chill song. I do like this. I feel like, yeah. Now, I feel like I have to uh, go into like some weird ASMR voice for this. I can't really be my usual hyper self with this. It's, uh, it's a little strange, but we are going to have, once again, zo as, uh, Zombie versus Wob and Jaden get set here on stream. To take you through the rest of the bracket, uh, the winner of this will be facing BBM Hero, who, uh, frankly, the unsung hero of the Beyond Beast Mode crew from out in Allentown. And maybe he'll be scouting out his competition here. But, folks, to Pokemon Stadium 2 we go for January's Monthly here at Bros Calamity. The action gets started here at Hat Bro with some aggressive Yoshi play here from Zombie. And kind of hard to glean what the game plan is here from Jaden. I mean, he's pressing a lot of buttons, but it's... Zombie shielding all of them. Soccer ball being broken out. I'm a, I'm a man of football myself, so do appreciate that. However, Zombie none too appreciative. Catches him with the aerials, and it's a lot of end lag on those air dodges. He'll need to time those out just a little better, Will Wob and Jaden, if he hopes to advance in winner's bracket to face beyond Beast Mode's hero. Oh, and the smash comes out, Zombie. Beautiful stuff to take stock number one. Timing out those dodges just a little better. Is Zombie and, well, could have timed that a little better, admittedly, as he will lose his first stock and only 18% damage. So Jaden, very much still in this. Down to. Yeah, that down air is something else from Yoshi. It's always been one of the better weapons in the repertoire of the giant, not a giant headed dinosaur. I don't know why I was about to say that. I mean, it is a rather large head. Uses it for that forward smash, so makes sense, right? Zombie trying to get back on stage, nothing doing. Says Jaden. Oh, and the neutral be right to the face. No respect whatsoever from Jaden. A little bit of attitude about him. And there you go. That's it was a bit of a slow start from Jaden, but he seems to be picking up on Zombie's tendencies relatively quickly. Zombie perhaps being just a little too aggressive for his own good. Ducks the neutral B. Follows it up with a forward smash, and that'll take stock number two. Tilt's coming out. Jab. And Jin may be trying to catch something in the air. And Zombie mixing him up by going low instead of uh, instead of high. Side B once again. A little bit of deep breathing. It's always good to breathe deep, folks. We shorten our breath and it gets us all tense and all that. But sometimes when you breathe deep, it helps you uh, improve your smash play. Sometimes it helps literally improve your character. So... Definitely remember that. In and out, folks. Zombie. Oh, my gosh. Might have to catch his breath after that one. He's sitting at 150%. Now, uh, once again, winner of this one, playing BBM Hero. Only a few, uh, few DQs in the bracket thus far. Some people just not able to get here in time for their matches. Not among them is Zombie and Wob and Jaden and Zombie bringing it back, sitting at 167%, staving off death just long enough to take game number one. And that Yoshi, gotta love the Akuma pose. Something else. But that is how we kick off the monthly here in Hatboro, Pennsylvania. Our monthly tournament that's always right here on twitch.tv slash bros underscore calamity. Folks, if you enjoy that, Matt, if you enjoy this kind of action, 
this uh, the high quality gameplay that only the tri-state region can offer you you're going to want to follow us over on twitch.tv slash clash tournaments as well shout out to chia for everything that she does to help advance the bros calamity brand and giving us the platform with which to broadcast uh talents such as 6wx such as uh blazing pasta such as hero who's waiting for one of these two players and uh the strikes did not include Kalos. That will be the destination for game number two. I kind of like this pick from uh, from uh, Jaden. Maybe thinking about the counter pick? No, he's sticking with Wii Fit. In game number two, to Kalos we go. Gonna want to make use of good use of those platforms if he's going to uh, if he's going to advance. Get the reverse 2-0. And as uh, Zombie carrying his 1-0 lead into game number two, looking to capitalize on the momentum that he's carried from uh, from that victory at Pokemon Stadium. Ooh, header right to the face. Folks, I played soccer. It is not fun taking a soccer ball to the face. Uh, a little bit of knockback. I was in hit stun for quite a bit. Joining me on the microphone, you know, speaking of stunning, rocking the purple sweater, I like it. Uh, really, more of a plum color. Is uh, is Uno? How you doing, Uno? Um, I'm doing uh, fantastic today, Stu. Uh, we're here at the monthly today. You know, uh, it's pretty cold over here in the area. Oh no, it's brick out there, man. Hat yes. bro, it's a, uh, it's the Northeast, folks. Oh my <laughs> gosh! Speaking wow. of brick, right off the rim and down below, so who go do we, zombie. Who do we have here so right now? It's uh, right now, this is uh, Zombie, who has a 1-0 lead right now, but Jaden is carrying a boatload of momentum right until that aerial. He uh, as he loses his first stock. However, he took two off of Zombie in that uh, in that same span. So, We Fit versus Yoshi. Not exactly the sort of matchup that I had to study in Smash <laughs> 4 all that often, yes. but uh, definitely an interesting one, Uno. Mm -hmm. Definitely. When you have a We Fit, we fit's usual game plan here is to um, not really try to aggress too much, try to play that ledge game as proper as possible. But when you have a character like Yoshi who has great buttons like that, it makes it a pretty difficult to play your game. So you're gonna have to kind of mix it up sometimes, you know, in these kind of situations. Ooh. But here we are, great down B coming from Zombie so far, and a Ooh. up air to connect. That's Playing a little bit of volleyball with We Fit Trainer was Zombie and Jaden looking to tie this up, but he's sitting at 149. And the last game, Zombie did get the kill while sitting at 167. He will get no such opportunity this time. Jaden evens it up at one. Now, what did you see that was so impressive from Jaden as uh, from that game number two? We saw him get up close and personal with that Yoshi. Not the easiest thing to do considering how he can move. Yes. But uh, and as we have Hero here. Uh, awaiting his opponent here. He will be playing the winner of this matchup. I think I mentioned that four times, but yeah, you yeah. absolutely will. No, so uh, absolutely shout outs to Hero. Yeah, you, you know, yeah. study your opponent, you know. Yeah, absolutely. Get, uh, make sure you know what they're coming in with so there's no surprises when, you know, you go up to bat. But... Yeah. Know yourself, great. know your opponent. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. Yes. Yeah, you know, you know I gotta break out the art of war quotes. You know <laughs> how it is. Exactly. But here we are now in a switch to Inkling coming zombie. Um Z uh zombie, you know, that Yoshi not working out too well. So I guess the switch to Inkling yeah. may the be more comfortable pick here. The pocket inkling that he was talking about. He uh Perhaps thinking he's found out my Yoshi, mm -hmm. so he's got to go with the freshest squid on the block. Absolutely, and it's the um, the blue uh, school school kid. Uh, I I don't know color. about this skin, man. I, I I think it's the shirt and the glasses. It kind of looks like a hipster squid. Yeah, yeah. Not it's not my favorite skin, but definitely um one to uh the joke that i make about it is that it looks like it's ready to go to an ex ambassadors concert <laughs> i don't know i see i see I, i'm going to get honestly. some hate for that i just know <laughs> folks if you don't like the comment that i made 
Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe here at Bros <laughs> Calamity Vods. <laughs> now, oh, now we're going to get an overflood of them. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> we're going to get an overflood of them. But hey, traffic is traffic. Interestingly enough, um, this is actually uh, Jaden's. Uh, what? Jaden? Yeah, this was Jaden's counter pick. Oh, no. And Zombie oh my. choosing to run it back. And now it seems that Zombie's taking it over with this inkling. So this is a brand new game that we're seeing here. And not only that, Jaden with the bad mistake off of the side. I, I don't like using words like that to describe uh, to describe anyone's play, but there's no mistake about it. That was an, uh, an unfortunate event that we saw from Jaden off of the side. It was basically an SD, could not recover enough with the up B. Going off the ledge, looking for something, coming up with a whole lot of nothing and coming back with one less stock. Yeah, One fewer stock. Now Jaden being forced to play catch up here at this time. Um, it's even now. Okay, Jaden gets a nice up smash read, and that's going to, you know, put himself in a little bit more of a way to maybe close the gap here on this uh, last tournament stock in the winners. Yeah, this is doable for, uh, for Jaden. However... Certainly, Zombie will have something to say about this. He gets himself back to neutral again. The hitbox on that uh, side B is not something to be underestimated. Not the safest thing in the world, though, however, either. And he gets fully inked off of that up smash. That blaster up close. Good aim, Zombie. And he shoots himself right into round two. Zombie takes it two to one. Jaden trying to space himself out of that range, but gets clipped by the scoop of the up smash in the blaster. It actually has a hitbox that hits him into it, yep. and which is why that hit, that hit, and it connected like that. And that was um, fantastic spacing coming from Zombie. But, of yep. course, Jaden, um, that was a great play by him, you know, running it all the way to game three, of course. Scooped up and blasted out, however, was Jaden in that particular matchup. Zombie will take it 2-1. to one. So uh, that pocket inkling coming out and proving to be uh, proving to be useful as uh, he did take it with game one with Yoshi and got to say eked it out. So that set could have gone either way. We could very well have seen a 2-0 victory from, uh, from Jaden as well, but sometimes that's how the cards fall. And unfortunately, it really could have gone either way, but it will be. Uh, Jaden, excuse me, zombie facing hero in yes. winner's round.